क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोज फ्रॉम ई कीडा हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी हाउ टू फॉर्म अ पर्टिकुलर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन सो लेट एस स्टार्ट so before starting with the formation of differential equation the first topic that we should understand is what is an arbitrary constant different values according to the specified condition is called as a arbitrary constant up till now we have only understood the word constant which has a fixed value if i say the value of g is 9.8 meter per second square so it is basically a fixed value but if i say for a particular equation a constant changes so that becomes an arbitrary constant let us understand this by a particular example suppose we have a line y is equal to mx which is a straight line passing through the origin and having a slope m now in this case m is called as a arbitrary constant or also called as a parameter why it is called as a arbitrary constant let us see the line y is equal to mx basically represents a family of line y is equal to mx is not a single line if you change the values of m we will get different types of line which are passing through the origin so here you can see the values of m will change for different types of line if i say y is equal to x this line will pass through the origin making an angle of 45 degree similarly if i say y is equal to 2x or y is equal to 3x the behavior of the line or you can say the inclination of the line will change so in this case we know that m is a slope of line which is a constant but more specifically m is called as an arbitrary constant now to form a differential equation the first step that we are going to see is after differentiation we will try to eliminate this arbitrary constant so we have a line y is equal to mx and after differentiating with respect to x we will get dy by dx is equal to m so the value of first derivative is equal to m now let us substitute the value of m as dy by dx in the original equation so the original equation was y is equal to mx that will give you y is equal to dy by dx into x or simply you can say dy by dx is equal to y upon x as you can see we have already obtained a differential equation and at the same time we have eliminated the arbitrary constant now let us see what is a pure constant so pure constant is exactly opposite of a arbitrary constant in arbitrary constant we have said its value changes from case to case but in constant or a pure constant we say its value is always fixed for any specified conditions so the definition for pure constant is the value which remains constant with respect to time and space whenever you will calculate it it will be same only so such constants are called as pure constants for example in the given relation we have x is equal to a sin kt plus b so here we have three different constant a b and k out of that k is a pure constant while the remaining two a and b will be the arbitrary constant now let us see the steps that are required to form the differential equation so in point number 1 we need to observe the relation carefully and calculate or count the numbers of arbitrary constant see we have n numbers of arbitrary constants the second step is that differentiate this relation n times so if we have two arbitrary constant we'll go for second order derivative if we have one arbitrary constant we'll go for only first derivative after doing so we will have total n plus 1 different types of expression first is the original function and second will be number of derivatives now to eliminate this arbitrary constant you can solve this n plus 1 expressions either by substitution method or you can use the determinant method i hope friends you have understood how to form the differential equation and the process that is required for it thank you for watching this video stay tuned with ikida and subscribe to ikida